Hi everyone, in this video I'll show you how to add, edit and style text in WordPress using the Visual Composer website builder. Let's start by opening a page here from the WordPress admin panel. From here, we can add some text by opening the add content window and choosing the text block element. That opened the tiny MC editor where you can edit and style your text. Simply replace the placeholder text and everything else is up to you. As with most text editors, you can choose the heading, make the text bold or italic, make a bulleted list or numbered list. However, Visual Composer offers some advanced options too, like changing the font for example. You can choose between all Google fonts here. All other options are the same as in already well-known Google Docs or Word documents. If these text styling options aren't enough, you can also add an extra class name to this element and add some additional CSS. You can do that in the settings and then the custom CSS tab. Here you can get creative and add anything you want. Another thing you can do with the text is make it dynamic with the dynamic content feature. You can do that if you click on the dynamic content icon. Here, if you enable the toggle, you'll be able to choose the source from where the information will be taken. It can be a post or some custom post type. Then you can choose what kind of information will be taken here in the dropdown. So for text, it can be the title or anything else you see in the list. So if this would be an archive page for a blog, you could choose the title of the specific post and then if you ever decide to change it, the title of the post, I mean, it will automatically change on this page too. I also wanted to mention a couple of other text elements you can find in Visual Composer, like the Google heading where you can change parameters like font, font style, font size and many more. There's also the double title element where you can adjust each title individually for a cool looking effect. Then there are a ton of other elements that include text in the hub, like the feature description, hero section, or feature section. There you'll see the already familiar tiny MC editor. So those controls you already know. And that's it for text. So thank you all for watching and see you in the next one.